So in your wholesaling business, uh, what would you say your average um, assignment fees are these days? Uh, well, consistently they were 17 for a couple years in a row. I would say the average is probably somewhere around 15 right now. Um, I get a lot of, uh, because my build company and my flip company are so big, we buy a lot of inventory. And so we will, we will methodically sell that off if the rotation isn't right, or I don't feel it's the right neighborhood for the types of houses I'm doing or whatever the case is. Right. But if there's 10 to 20 grand to be made, uh, we'll make it. And so I, I'm not going to pass on deals. I did go through a stage in wholesaling where I was being really critical with the price and I didn't want to take anything if there wasn't, you know, a good spread in it. And so I'm not as picky now. I, I just want to feed the people. And so for me, uh, flipping, I have a unique position that I own Gem State Cash Offer, which is our wholesale company um, out of Idaho. So I get to see all these deals, but you got to remember that most of the flippers and builders out there don't have a wholesale company that they can lean on to get their inventory. And I understand that. And so I have, I have a decent amount of people that I don't know if they rely fully on me, but I, I feed them deals and I, I try to stay consistent, you know? So if I make five grand on a deal, and it's going to make sure that they have extra room in their budget to, to set them up for success, then I'm going to make five grand. If I buy low and I get it worked out and we maybe spend a month or two months on the lead and, um, or even five or six months at that point, and I make a hundred grand, uh, I'm going to make a hundred grand on that wholesale with the intent to make sure that there's value created for the flipper builder. So I kind of just dictate my, I don't have a metric where I say, this is going to be a percentage I'm going to sell it at. I found that each individual flipper has their own criteria and if the, the more we can adhere to them, uh, then we can get bigger values. I have guys that do a lot of rentals. They don't need to buy them as cheap. They don't need as much room. They're not selling them. They're not paying commissions to realtors, you know? So uh, we have a deal. I make sure they have good rental inventory and they pay, they pay the, the fee for it. Um, and so, but I always give them inventory. So 